Hello everybody, it is your boy TwinPlays here, back with another video, I hope you guys are all doing amazing. In today's video, we're going to be talking about how to use plugins. I don't know if I've made a video on this, and I thought I might as well, because there are a lot of plugins out there, and I know a lot of people might not know how to use plugins, may want to make their own plugin, and there's a lot of things you can do. Um, so, in this short tutorial, we're going to be talking about plugins, they're super easy to do, nothing too complicated, so... Don't worry. Um, but yeah, so all you're really going to do first is you're going to go on to Studio now. Um, I'm already on here, so feel free to just get onto Studio. And once you're on Studio here now, um, there is going to be uh, these tabs. Now, mine might look a little different to yours because there is a new UI update. Um, just if you want to watch that video, I'll put that on the screen. But that's just uh, the, vid the video on how to turn off the other UI and make it the old version. But as you can tell, I actually have a lot of plugins. Now... When it comes to plugins, there's a lot of things you can use them for. Um, they're very, very useful. Okay, and I will just tell you that now. But um, what you're going to do is you're going to just do what I just said. There's a manage plugins button. Okay, now this is where, sorry, I have to probably move my thing. But um, this is where all the plugins will be. Now in here, um, you can like turn yours on and off. But for you, you probably won't have anything in here. So um, I'm going to update mine, of course. But uh, there is a plugins folder as well, if you'd like. That just opens up a folder, but um, we're not going to be worrying about that. So in here, in the toolbox, okay, so you find toolbox, you go home, toolbox right here. In the uh, toolbox area, you're going to go to plugins, and you're going to be able to find all the plugins you need. Now, there is a lot of things, okay? So as you can tell, there is a building plugin area. So there's like Studio Build Light, there's beam handles, smooth edges, there's like this one's for building. Um, honestly, I actually do have this one right here. The Stravin, the, this one right here is really good. Um, but yeah, there is a lot of things. Now, this is really up to you guys. Um, honestly, you can go ahead and honestly, like, get as much as you want here. I personally have, like, Moon Animator. Uh, oh, this is the second one. Yeah, the second one's only if you really like to animate, but I, it's not a necessity for me. There's, like, lighting, um, there's, like, I don't know, there's, like, a lot of things in here. So, original reclasser, so this, like, uh, designed to make the way out of time. I don't know, there's a lot of stuff in here. Um, but, yeah, I mean, you, you can kind of just mess around. I have tool grip editor, this one's a big one. Um, but I'm going to show you, of course, how this works. This interface tools is really nice. I actually have this one, too. Looks like you have to buy it now, which kind of is stupid. They're making it for everything. Um, also, same for this. I have this one as well, which is funny why it's already up here, but... Um, there's just a lot of things you can do. Now, when you get these, I'll show you, when we go back to plugins and we go into manage plugins, it's going to turn you to this. This is where you can turn them on and off, of course. So up to you what you want on and off. Um, I have so many in here. I like try and keep it organized as much as I can, but like, you know, uh, there's this instant tagging button, which is really, really helpful. Um, and why do we use plugins? You know, so they, what's the why behind everything now? This is honestly a simple question because, um, you know, it makes your progression for game, game development so much faster. Now, um, when it comes to certain things, like when we were talking about the Avatar series, if you guys are looking into the Avatar series, um, this is like such a nice plugin because I can just use it by going into here and, you know, I could import my avatar, you know. So there's just so many things. Um, you know, if I hit insert like Lotus R15, Boom, it's already in your game. I don't have to do anything. Like, there's just all these simple things you can do. Um, Load Character Pro is the, I think it's not free anymore. Um, so, this one you do have to pay for it. But, um, I can, you know, unfortunately, a lot of these things are becoming paid for. Um, but it's just because of the way you use things. Um, I did post other videos about data store editors. So, there's the Data Delve, which is also a very good data store editor. Um, I don't know if it's any of these ones up here. But, um, you know, going to Data Delve, actually, it's probably in here somewhere. But, um, you know, I, I've made a lot of videos on these, so I recommend just kind of, uh, you know, going about getting some plugins. Now, all your plugins are in here, super simple stuff. Um, like I said, you can get as many plugins as you want. Like as, as, as I can keep going across to the right, it's going to create, create more plugins, Ugh, plugins. Um, now, like I said, there's just so many things you can use plugins for. So what I recommend is, you know, take some time to go through these and just think about what you need. Um, I have these specifically, which is like, uh, you know, gap fill. This is for fun. This tracks your hours in the studio, which this isn't right. Cause I've got this like a year ago, but, um, just like little fun things. And then like UGC stuff, uh, there's like 
building tools, you know, there's 3D text. This is a great uh, one to get, you know, you can get 3D text. But yeah, like I said, this really just helps you out um, in many ways. Um, so yeah, go go ahead, go ahead and just, you know, mess around with, with plugins and stuff. Now, uh, I will be releasing more videos on plugins. I actually have a bunch of videos talking about avatar plugins. But, um, you know, there's there's definitely some things you can do to try and find, uh, you know, the ones you want. I don't know if you could search up like avatar or something, um, but like these ones will have like a bunch of stuff in here. So, you know, do do what you need for, you know, whatever, um, but just use plugins when you can. OK, they're very, very, very helpful. Um, but yeah, that's um, kind of it, you guys, just like a simple like tutorial talking about you know how you use plugins now when it comes to creating plugins it's a little bit of a different story um it's a lot of programming that goes into that which i can make a separate video on um but it's basically you know something you can sell as well if you want to do that um but that's you know that's up to you um i hope you guys enjoy this little short tutorial and um yeah you guys let me know if you have any more questions about certain things but very simple to use plugins and i really recommend them if you are going to be a developer on roblox have a good day